haven't done lock video in a while, so I figure I'd come to you guys, tell you what's been going on with my hair, because after I had the baby, I was ready to cut this stuff off, y'all. I was. I don't know why. I had a, I had a very, very... I had some moments of unclarity because I was ready to cut my hair off, but my boyfriend said he would leave me, so I reconsidered. But hi, it's Kels here, and I am, well shoot, I'm almost four, four years in. Two months will be four years that I've had my locks, and... I still think it's the best thing that I've ever done. I just, I get frustrated sometimes when they kind of thin out and they get like thin spots. Like I feel like they're just gonna, if I pull it, it'll um, fall out. And it's not a lot, it's not a lot at all, but I'm very particular so I get frustrated and I got to a point after the baby where I was just very frustrated, very frustrated. But I think that I've fixed it. I've um, actually, maybe in two parts. I think I did one up here. And I did one in the back where I conjoined two. Because they felt so loose. And I was like, if I lost a lock up here, I'd be devastated. You'd be like, um, you're missing some hair. <laughs> so, I was very frustrated. I was ready to cut these things off. But... I didn't and I dyed it <laughs> so um, I'm not um, for a long time I wasn't able to well because I was pregnant I couldn't dye my hair so it's devastating because I'm I dye my hair like every couple of months so um, I actually bleached the top here and I felt like it made it thinner so I was like Ugh lose lose I was just like I'm just not gonna win at all but um, when I can join those up here um, I let the bleach I did the bleach about a month ago month and a half ago so I did the bleach and then I went and I, I let it breathe for a couple you know a couple of weeks so that you know I wasn't putting so much strain on my hair and then I did the red which is a rinse. I didn't do semi-permanent. I didn't do permanent. I did a semi-permanent rinse on, on this part just to get this red color. And then I did the black on the the other parts. Um, just, to get, just for something different. I get so bored with everything. So I just wanted to give myself some color. I wanted to go bright, bright, but I'm at work. I'm, um, associate director can't do all of that because I swear I'd walk here with purple pink and blue hair if I if I could um other than that um it's growing significantly it's it has grown significantly over the last 10 months because I was pregnant so I thank my baby for giving me inches thank you thank you baby um but I did not start with short hair. I had a decent length of hair that I started with. I coiled it, so my four years might not be your four years because I did have some hair when I started. So you'd be like, that's she lying. She ain't had hair for four years because my hair only up to my shoulders now. I started with some hair and I got a little boost because I had a baby. So, don't be, you know, um, discouraged. Locks are awesome. Locks are awesome. Um, as far as like who does my hair, my boyfriend's friend, she, she does locks. Um, she does a good job. She does a good job. She definitely um, hooked me up a couple of times. I haven't been in the last couple of months. Like four months. Yeah, probably like four months. Because um, I went like a couple of weeks before I had the baby. 
Uh, I want to let my hair breathe. I actually did my hair most recently. I twisted it. And then I put it in um, some cornrows. I, I don't do I don't do um, designs at all. Don't don't get me started. I'll throw some braids in there, but um, I twisted it recently. But I think I'm just gonna let my hair breathe for a little while because, like I said, it is thinning, and I want to um, nurture it, nurture it back to life, 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 life. Um, but you know, if you have any questions. Where you are in your process, um, challenges, feel free. Put a comment under, send me a message, whatever. I'm free to communicate so with somebody that's looking for something that they don't know. Like, I'm always looking for something that I don't know. So, I'm here. Until next time, guys.